me and my family who have a computer, which was given to me as a gift when I passed my grade nine exams. I don't use it for the internet because I do not have a modem. Mainly, I like to play video games on the computer. Competing with my brother, I am attending school right now. I'm in 10th grade. I go to, the, to school on the mid-morning session. My favorite subject right now is biology. I like biology because it talks about how human interact and how they care for the environment. Yeah, mainly I use my mom's phone for research. At school, we have maybe a topic as a group discussion. We, we make a conference with my friends. We start discussing how we can overcome this, how we can do that together on my, on my, my, on my, my, my mom's phone. I decided to buy the phone since the pandemic started. It was a challenge for the children to, to learn. They were not going to school. It's not very affordable, just chance. When you chance money, then you buy talk time, you make bundles for the, for the children to study. It is a bit challenging. Like now, we do not have electricity. Electricity has been gone since yesterday around maybe 9, 9 a.m. Right now, I'm not using the computer or my mom's phone because we cannot be able to charge it. It is also a frustration because you buy bundles for 20 quarter and then maybe the lights have, be, have been gone maybe since yesterday. And then when you, when you come back, you find that the bundles have expired. They have to sacrifice, they have to forego to get a bundle. Because bundles here are really expensive. They expire within a short period of time, like a 24-hour period. Within that 24-hour period, there's no power, there's a break of power, maybe half a day. So it's a frustration, really, for the hard end money. Without these things, even the children, that the youth that are going to school nowadays, some lessons are coming by virtue of a phone. It's very, very important nowadays.